the history of the evolution of the sports car, there's probably never been a more exciting car than the current generation Corvette Z06. At MTI Racing, the first thing we wanted to do was get our hands on one of these cars in completely stock form and take it to a racetrack, pound on it, and find out what its strengths and weaknesses were. Then we started development programs to try to make everything that that car does one or two or more steps better. So we looked at all aspects of the vehicle. It was actually aerodynamics where we started. We went to the wind tunnel after we had discovered at the track testing that the car had a little bit of high speed instability. So what do we do? We take it to the wind tunnel in the heart of NASCAR country and we establish a baseline on a completely stock Z06. But once we've done that, then we set about the development curve of making changes on the car to try to make that car better. Aerodyne Wind Tunnel in Mooresville is a facility that tests Winston Cup, Bush, and truck vehicles. We test a lot of the teams in NASCAR, and they come on a regular basis to us. Road race guys come, and they're looking for downforce and balance in the cars. We test at 85 miles an hour. We can get uh, coefficients off that. It allows us to scale the data so we can, you know, we can put in you know, 100 miles an hour or 200 miles an hour, and you can scale the, the uh, forces to find out what's happening at that speed. We do have a system where we can actually you know, show you the pounds and downforce or the pounds and drag or the, the horsepower required to, to overcome that air resistance. For smoke testing, we run the tunnel at 45 miles an hour. The reason we do that is just to stand up. I mean, it's, when you start getting up to 60, 70 miles an hour, it gets really hard to stand in here. And uh, usually anything you see happening at 40 miles an hour is going to be happening at higher speeds. The cost of adding 100 horsepower to a race engine is about three times the cost of adding aero horsepower to a race vehicle. It costs less to make the car faster through the air than it does to put horsepower in the engine. At MTI Racing, we're not a fluff company. We're totally performance driven. So all of our aerodynamic improvements are not aesthetic. They are aesthetically pleasing, but any part that we bolt on or add to the car has got to be proven on the track and at the wind tunnel. develop the stuff on Reese's race cars and then he converts it over to the street with some mild changes. He also converts it over to customers who have Corvettes that race them. They, they have serious Corvettes, they're making a lot of power. Reese's aero packages make it very safe for these people to do this. He's got aero packages that are developed beyond most of the capabilities of the people who drive the cars. So we've gone to the wind tunnel and done lots of testing there. We've gone to the racetrack and accumulated lots of lap times. So what do we do with all that information? Well, there was two basic design parameters that we had for our aero package, simple and effective. We found in the wind tunnel that aero balance was about as important as the overall downforce. You wanted to add as much to the front as you did to the back. That's in simplified terms, but it really makes a big difference in the feel of the car. So what we've started with is a simple two-piece package that has a front splitter and a rear spoiler, both designed to be effective and achieve an aero balance. At MTI Racing, we achieved some pretty remarkable results with our standard aero package, but we're always wanting to take it to the extreme. So we developed a track package for the new Z06, consisting of carbon fiber rear wing, rear diffuser, flat bottom on the underside of the car, front splitter extension, and a carbon fiber extractor hood. Reese is a very unique person. People who use his stuff are guys who can't afford to go full-blown racing. But they go to the track with the same intensity and the same need to go fast and to enjoy the vehicle. The Corvette is a very powerful machine. The aero package on it is very, very serious. And it's probably been one of the biggest rewards for the development and improvement of the MTI Racing Package overall.